Um, I went to go clean it, accidentally punctured the pond. I popped a hole in it. Yeah, he's huge. Beautiful. Hey, what is Gucci Raw fam? If you guys aren't a part of the fastest, strongest fishing family on YouTube, what are you doing, bro? Smash that subscribe button and join the fastest, strongest fishing family on YouTube. Yeah. So, uh, what we're doing today is we have this beautiful little pond right here and uh it's totally epic excuse my dogs but it's totally epic and uh it's pretty cool for now but it's not something long term it's just too flimsy and too cheap for that but if you guys look in the background right here that total epic pond yes it got destroyed i was cleaning it yesterday and it went to crap to this beautiful little pool pond is that um i went to go clean it and i was just kind of scrubbing the bottom and uh i, I accidentally punked punctured uh accidentally punctured the pond i popped a hole in it but it's all right uh, a couple hundred bucks and uh, we're back in business everybody's so happy to be all together come on come on <gasps> oh goldie hi buddy hi oh do you want me to pet you i'll pet you come on who wants to suck on my fingers yes come on i love you too goldie i love you too girl come on come here come play with me come play with me baby who else? You, you guys want to suck on my finger? Oh, you're so cute, Goldie. Thank you so much, baby. So, all my fish, they're all aware that um, I'm just looking out for them. Uh, they know that the pond was getting pretty disgusting, so I had to get them all out of there. Um, some of them actually swam up to me and just kind of went right into the net and I ran them over and they're perfectly fine. All right, guys, so it is going to be a little bit of music. We're going to do like a uh, like a little time lapse type of thing. Uh, I'm not going to be always talking to you because I think it's going to get a little windy and a little rowdy. But we are going to be taking all my fish and putting them back in the pool pond. So no, come back. So that's what we're going to do. Let's do it. Ready? This is Steeler. All right, guys, this is Steeler. I hope you guys would know why she's, her name is Steeler. Get up close to her. Hi, Steeler. Hi, buddy. Hi. What'd she steal? She didn't steal anything. It's a football team. Huh? <laughs> hey, McCoy. Oh my gosh, McCoy has gotten so big. Yeah, wow. You ready? You guys see McCoy? This was my very first fish. He's beautiful. Oh yeah. You ready? Okay. Now see our nice gentle release, and there he goes. See her? Ready? Hey. This is a, uh, I think it's a Showa. To show a koi. Woo! I didn't know we were in the splash zone. <laughs> you're always, woo! You're always in the splash zone, and she's ready to go. Ready? Mm -hmm. I bet all my people were, were like, "What happened to her?" Yes, guys, this is my platinum. Beautiful. Yeah. Alright guys, it's time to get Cash out. Cash is getting a little spooky. Where is he? Well, he's wondering where all his buddies are. Cash is right here. Good boy. Relax. Relax. Yeah, he's huge. Beautiful. All right, guys. Beautiful. So that is Cash the Bass. He's huge. Nice gentle release. Beautiful. Nice and easy. Beautiful. He's like, yeah, I'm back home. There she goes. Cash the Bass, everybody. He's going. Guys, this is, this is Goldie, come on. She's doing awesome. 
What's up, Goldie? What's up? Hi, Aaron. Hey, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Does the game wardens know you got these fish? Yeah, they don't. They don't care. Everything's legal. Okay. Got it. There we go. That was easier than I thought. Hi, right, guys. So this is my little red tail. See him? He's gonna start grunting. He has gotten so big since I got him from SCK Cichlids. <laughs> SCK Cichlids, buddy, he is getting freaking huge. Uh, shout out to SCK Cichlids, SCK Cichlids. Uh, shout out to you guys for giving me this beautiful, look at him, he's already with the koi. That's his favorite little buddies right there. See him right there? But uh, yeah, he's so epic, I love him. They're all in like a little school. This is Mr. Savage. Mr. Savage is getting so big from whenever I caught him uh, with my buddy Blake. <laughs> Look at him, ain't he cool? His name is Mr. Savage because he's a little savage. Remember getting him? Remember when we went off and got him? Give him a little spook, touch him on the back of the fin, and he's off. This this koi right here, her name is Foxy, but she, I mean, if you guys can see right here, see that little speck right there? That's called a diamond. There's two. They're one on each side. She's getting her diamonds that are coming in. Um, that makes her, like, double in value easily once she has straight diamonds all the way down her backbone. Um, the best diamonds are the ones that really you can't see, but they're there, for my opinion. Uh, remember, koi are valued at by the owner and the buyer there's not a price set price on any koi remember that i love her so much isn't she pretty and this is a pure platinum guys good look at her real quick so what i'm doing with this i'm actually getting the fish with this net uh, this is like a $50 net from, uh, I guess, Bass Pro. And then this is also from Bass Pro. And this is actually a rubber net. And what the rubber net does, it doesn't actually, um, it doesn't like bind on itself. Like you can't twist this net and it won't like be like fishing line and cinch. That's the good thing about this. It's just rubber and it stretches. This, you see the knots that are already in the net? that's already cinching. You can see it cinching. So if I made a, a big circle like this and cinched it, it would stay. This, it's just stretchy and rubbery and it doesn't cinch down and it doesn't hurt the fish. That's what's good about it. That's why it's so expensive. This net right here is $100. Hey everybody, who remembers this fish? If you guys watched my videos for a long time, this is actually the bluegill. This is the bluegill that was in my tank a super long time ago. And uh, it's still alive, and it's still in the pond. It's actually a part of the pond. Uh, Cash purposely doesn't eat this fish because he sees him as like a brother. Um, I've actually taken bigger bluegill like this and threw them in, and they got swamped immediately. But they're not a part of the pond, so they don't get eaten. I'm sure if Cash was really hungry and I took that bluegill and I threw him in there on top, and he just saw a bait coming to him, like feeding time, I'm pretty sure he would swamp the heck out of it, but a free swimming bait like that? Nah, there he's a part of the pond. He's not getting eaten. He's too big to get eaten like that. Hey, oh, what's good to you, Rolfam? Thank you guys so much for watching to the end of the video. I love you, Rolfam, so much. This pond was so awesome, and we used it just perfectly. It was only like 30 bucks on Amazon. It did us justice. It, it, it served its purpose. Now it's time to break that thing down. We have the pool pond back, yes. We accidentally destroyed the pool pond. The tree fell on it. We accidentally hit it when we were scrubbing on it. <laughs> it's all right, guys. You guys just saw Cash the Bass. So epic. 
I love you, Rolf fam, and I'll see you later. Peace!